back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you some pieces from Express. I have partnered with them for this video and I'm so excited because I've always wanted to try Express and like invest in some of their stuff because I've been in the store, I've felt their clothes and know that it's really good quality. And I've always said that I want to invest in really good basics. That way I don't have to keep buying all these clothes every fall, every winter. I can kind of just dress up or dress down my basics that I have. So today I'm gonna to be showing you the items that I picked up. I mostly tried to get basics, things that I feel like I can wear year round, like I said, that are gonna be more of investment pieces just because they are higher quality and a little more expensive. Uh, so I'm gonna stop rambling and all that, but yeah, if you like any of these pieces, of course, I will have everything linked down below for you guys. So make sure that you check them out if you do. If you do check them out, thank you so very much. I do receive a small commission, so that's greatly appreciated. Any support here is appreciated, a view is appreciated. Also, I totally forgot to mention that I do have a discount code for you guys. I'll have it here on the screen as well in the description box below, and that's gonna get you 15% off um, in online and in stores. So go ahead and take advantage of that discount code. Other than that, make sure that you're subscribed to this channel, you like this video, so you can get more try on hauls um, if this is what you like. And other than that, we're gonna just jump right into this video. So the first basic item I guess you can say I got was some basic jeans so I really wanted to try out some um, some of their jeans I love the wash of these ones they are like ripped in the front and then I loved the cut off bottom so it's like a fringe hand or it's like a rough cut on the bottom I'm really into that right now I think that's really in right now so these are ankle legging mid-rise so not super high rise they're just mid-rise um, I kind of like a mid-rise jean because I have a short torso so the high rise tends to be a little too high so I'm gonna go ahead and throw these ones on and we'll see how they look how they fit I'm excited I think they're gonna fit bomb they feel really good quality feels great so let's go ahead and try them on so these are the jeans I am obsessed with them they fit so good they feel so good on they fit the butt really really well the only thing I will say is I think I did get the wrong length size. I didn't really pay attention to that. Um, so that's really my fault. Um, for the cutoff hem, I wanted it to be a little shorter so it can kind of show some ankle. Please excuse my ratchet toes. They are not painted. They are chipping and all that, but it's okay. I know y'all y'all pedicure don't be 100% every time. Okay, like this video and comment down below if you be having some ratchet toes sometimes too. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, love the quality of these jeans. I love where they come. I love... Um, the mid-rise where it's not too high it does have a little bit of um, like it's not super snug around here um, but really the only jeans that have ever done that for me is Fashion Nova and those are more of a jegging type material I would say so I can't really compare like jean quality jeans to jeggings because of course those are going to be a little bit more fitted um, so I'm not mad about these ones it's not too much it doesn't poke out too much in the back so yeah, and I'm wearing a super crop top with these, so yeah, I love them, love the wash, love the fit, love the color, super cute basic. Okay, so for my next basic item, I got this cute little manila, what color is this? Is this manila? I want to say manila, but it's probably not the right. Yeah, I don't know. It's just like a cream, a cream. Let's use cream, okay, instead of manila. Um, it's a cream like tank. I love these type of tanks because when I mean you can dress these ones up, you really can. I always love, like if I'm going for an interview, I always usually wear one of these tanks with a blazer. Get the job every single time. So <laughs> if you've been trying to go for jobs and ain't getting it, get one of these tanks in a blazer, you'll grab the job, okay sis? And thank me later. No, but um, I really love these because you can just wear it like this and tuck it in and it'll be super elegant. Or you could dress it up with a blazer and all that. And so I'm gonna show you guys how I like to wear it with just some regular jeans. So I just put on like a bandeau top with this really just to show you guys how you know it looks because you can't really wear a bra with it. So I don't have uh, nipple covers at the moment so I just have like this bandeau top but or bandeau, I don't know how you say it, but I would suggest nipple covers for these because you can't really wear a bra or a strapless. I mean, I guess you could, but it's probably still like show because it has a low V. Um, but yeah, so I would pair it with these. I definitely tuck it in. I just love that it adds like an elegant like look. And so this is how the shirt looks like this. And I love how it looks like really like elegant. It kind of dresses up just some plain jeans. You could throw on some heels and this is definitely like a super cute date night outfit, 
so I love it. It feels really good. It's not see-through or anything. Um, and then you have adjustable straps as well. So I can adjust this lower or up more if I want. I'm gonna keep it right here just because, like I said, my situation with my bandeau top is just not the cutest, so I don't want that to show. Um, but I'm just gonna show you, I'm gonna stay in this and show you guys my next item because it very much goes with this. So this next item is definitely an investment because I feel like every woman or every boss woman needs to have a bomb blazer, like the go-to blazer, like that fits you perfect. You can wear it to inter any interview, you can wear it to any party and still slay. And I found it, y'all. This blazer is so bomb, okay? Now, I will tell you guys, it is $128, so that is a steep price, but it is so quality, it is, feels so good on, and you will see, it literally fits me like a glove. I've already tried it on, because I couldn't wait once I seen it. I was like, oh my gosh, this is the best blazer ever. It just fits so well. Like, who, who's not getting the job? Who? Who's not getting the job? This fits so freaking well. Like, honestly, I've never had a blazer and I can just do whatever and it's not like restricting, but it's so fitting. I just feel like a complete boss in this. Um, it's like, it's very like petite. It's not like bulky and the shoulder pads aren't, there is shoulder pads, but they're very slight and it's not like too much. It just, I, I'm obsessed with this blazer. Honestly, when I put it on, I was like, I cannot believe how well it fits. So, um, definitely the best fitting blazer I've ever owned. So this is not a definite like staple that you need to have in your closet. A really, really good blazer because at any point, any given time, you need to be able to put this on and be like, look, we're making boss moves. Don't talk to me, I'm making boss moves. You know what I mean? You just feel like a boss when you put on a blazer. I do, just like, makes me feel like I'm going to get some money or something. Okay. I wanna just show you guys the inside detail too. So it's like a silk stripe in the inside. It's so comfy, you guys, just so comfy. Just really super good quality. I'm just so happy that I have this now because I know I'll have that for years and years to come. So it definitely is um, an investment. Okay, so this is the next outfit. And I'm not gonna lie, I have never owned something like this, so on the website, I was trying to post a picture of how the girl looked when she was wearing it. I don't really exactly remember how she styled it, but I was trying to get something that was very like appropriate, classy, and different than what I have in my closet, and this definitely hit the mark for that. Although, I have to say this is not my usual style, so seeing myself in this, is kind of weird. Um, I'm not mad at the fit. I feel like if it was a little tighter here, it'd just be that much more like um, flattering. But I don't think it's supposed to be that type of dress that's super tight. Um, with the shoulders and everything, I don't know, I'm feeling a bit out of my comfort zone. But I don't, I'm not mad at it. I don't think it looks ugly. I think it fits how it's supposed to fit. I think I wasn't ready for it. Um, but I don't, I don't know if this is a basic that will go in your closet, per se. I think um, this is like, you know, if, if you know how to style it. Because I'm sitting here like, what am I going to style this with? But it feels really great. The quality is great. Like, the quality on these items is superb. But I just don't know where I'm going to find, like, where I'm going to wear this to. This is definitely a church dress. Could wear this to church. So these are the leather pants. They fit so good, they're so soft inside. I paired them with these little snakeskin boots and just an oversized white tee. I really love, like I said, these are like a statement piece and they feel so good. I'm so happy that I found some really good like leather pants that actually look like pants and not like jeggings because they have like the pockets. They don't have front pockets, like actual front pockets, but they're like a matte, like a matte, not too shiny, they're not like, plasticky looking, you know, they look like really super quality, super nice, so um, I love that. I would probably just like tuck my shirt like this, probably wear it like that, or out. However, you could throw a jean jacket with it. Sorry you can't see my face, but the way my setup is, it's just so hard to get my full body in it. So that's kind of how I would so I, that's kind of how I would pair it with the jean jacket and the boots. And I love... Okay, these next are some flare. These fit 
so cute. So they have this built in, actually they're a little bit big around the waist, but that's just always, just always. So they're super bell bottoms on the bottom, um, but they have this super cute jean like belt that comes with it. And you can tie this into a cute little bow. I think this is just the cutest ever. I wouldn't pair it with this top probably, but honestly, I've been like moving and all my stuff is like packed everywhere, so just bear with me right now. Um, but they fit so cute. I love the design on the butt. It's just like two lines down. And the side, it's so cute. So these are definite 10 out of 10. Like that. I just love, they're, de they're definitely different. I guess I can consider these a basic because you do need a bell bottom jean in your closet. Like just at least one bell bottom. I know we all about the skinnies right now. The skinnies are the craze, but like just one cute bell bottom that just make your booty pop. That's a must. 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 I'm actually like so sleep deprived right now and I'm probably gonna edit this and be like cringing the whole time because I am trying to work on not being a perfectionist and just getting up videos and you guys let me know if like stuff bothers you like the fact that like you can't see me talk and things like that because I'm trying to really not let all that stuff bother me and get up content because sometimes I just get so frustrated with the circumstance and then I'll be like eh whatever F it I'm not doing the video so this is what we're working with today. I'm sorry that the angles are probably not the best. The lighting is not the best, but you know, we'll get So the next staple that I have is just a cheetah print dress. Now, you don't have to have a dress, but something cheetah print. I love a good cheetah print. I know some people hate animal prints. This dress, I was like, okay, I freaking need. First of all, it's the best cheetah print I've ever seen. Like, this is like, or is this not, it's not even cheetah. Is it cheetah or leopard? Cheetah, leopard, comment down below if you know. I'm horrible, I need to go back to grade school. Eh, whatever. Size small, it has a little tie around the waist on the side, and it has like, the bottom is like a wavy kind of situation. A wavy, I'm so tired. Um, anyway, super cute. I think that I can like wear this to any occasion. Super cute dress. I really love this, very safari feeling. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this on. I think this is our last piece. This is gonna be our last piece from the collection, but I really loved every single thing. Like the quality of all these clothes, so, so bomb. So let me go ahead and put this last one on. That way I'm not like, oh, I love everything. Let's give this one a shot first and let's see how it fits. And then I'll be back at the end. So I love the fit. It feels so good. So it has a little tight thing here. And I love the square neckline. I just think that's like super flattering. Really, really cute. It fits really good. And yeah, it's not super like super tight, but it's just fitting enough. And I think this is like, you know, why is it not a staple? Let's just say it's a staple, okay? Everybody needs a cheetah dress that looks like this, okay? Um, it's definitely not a staple, but I really needed it because when I looked at it, I was like, this is just so cute. I love the tie here. I think that kind of like just, yeah, so I basically love everything. Alrighty guys, so I really hope you guys loved everything in this collection and I hope you guys got some um, ideas for some staples that you could pick up if you like Express or maybe you never even heard of Express or you never try out their clothes. Definitely give them a shot because the quality, like I said, everything fits just so comfortable and good. I think when you're used to like getting, because I buy a lot of like the fast fashion, like really cheaper clothes and I don't mind. I know the quality is going to be pretty bad, but Sometimes when I wear it, I'm like, gosh, comfort is just not even, like, I already know I'm not going to be comfortable in it. I'm just, like, sacrificing, because they say beauty's pain. But it's really nice when you can feel comfortable and still sexy and cute. I feel like it just makes you feel, like, that much more confident when you're really comfortable in your outfit, too. So, um, yeah, I, I'm obsessed with the blazer. Blazer's hands down my favorite thing here because it just fits, like, a glove. Um, but everything else I loved as well. Like I would have to say that one dress, the other dress that I tried out was probably my least favorite. Only because like it's just so out of the box for me and I really don't know how it styled this. But I really wanted to get um, a pilgrimy outfit I guess. I'm just kidding. I really wanted to get like a different kind of outfit. And I mean it is a really nice quality dress. I just got to figure out what I'm going to like style with it like. 
do I put a fedora with that or what? I'm just kidding. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoy all my videos here. If you do like this, give this video a thumbs up, of course. And yeah, if you want to check out any of the items that I wore today, I'll have everything listed down below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!